you, thank you so much, Mr. Hamish. Thank you, and wish you all the best with your hard work. And just, I just wanna say we appreciate you. And uh, we have, I have achieved like ninety three percent. We have a question here. They say uh, a K represents a certain number, so K can be any number, it can be five, six, seven, any number. So they say uh, when inequality, so let me explain to you when inequality means is in equality. What that means? Equality means something equal, but inequality means not equal. For example, if you say uh, let's say uh, K equal to four, these are equal, but when inequality means it could be so. This is equality. So if you say inequality means it could be k is less than 4 so this sign here represents less than less than or you can say smaller than you know what I'm saying but um, this represents less or equal less or equal or smaller or equal because of this so this with that smaller or equal so if you do other way around like if you write like this means bigger than or greater than greater than or bigger than okay so if you do this means bigger or equal or you can say greater or equal say greater or equal greater or equal or equal so this is very very important make sure you put in your mind for example if you say this if you say k is greater than negative four what that means, means k is greater See this sign here? Uh, great. Smaller. <clears throat> Most of people know they use the right hand, so this is more powerful. So K is greater than negative 4. So sometimes they ask when they say represent this on another line. You see this one, the one with one side. This when you represent you represent on the cycle. Like if you have to represent another line. So all these are like this, you represent with the cycle with the empty side. Even this cycle, the empty side, but greater or equal. Or uh, mean greater, less or equal, greater than or equal, you present by solid duct. A solid duct. For example, somebody said represent this on number line. So, we got a number line like here. Let's say this is a number line. Let's assume this is 0, 3. K is greater than negative 4. Okay, look, negative 1, negative 2, negative 3, negative 4. So, this is negative 4. So, if you say greater than negative 4 means you start from here, you put Y, put, no, 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 excuse me, excuse me, sorry, is small 1. So you put only single. Greater means you go that way. So you go this way. You know what I'm saying? Now, let's say they say uh, this k is between 1 and uh, negative 2. Oh, so you start from negative 2 and you stop at 1. So where's negative 2? Here, this case. Negative 2 could be here. Let's say this is 0, negative 1, negative 2 here. So you want to put uh, is 1. You see negative 2 is? Just say not solid because just say excluded so we're gonna put it like this so the last point is one one is including because of this so one is gonna be included so you connect them you know what i'm saying why do i connect because start from negative two to one so something like that you know okay now let's go to the question now i don't want to waste no time let's go to the business so now they give uh, the something like a word problem. So they give you a problem. So this word problem, you're gonna to have to construct an algebra expression that you work it out. So how do they say here? A third, they say k represents a certain number. Or k represents a certain number. When the inequality, so you can understand what say inequality means they talk about these things here. So which inequality? Okay, a third of a number, so now number, what does that mean? Means we get our number, but a third of a number means that number divided by three is no greater if somebody say oh it's no greater than two means it can even be two but not more than two so it can either be two or no more than two that's what i say is no greater than k is no greater than whatever so it means it can be there if you say it's no greater than 100 means it can even be 100 but not more than so it can be equal to 100 but not more than 100. so let's say here a third of a number so number is k third of that number is no greater what that means means it can be less or equal because it can be that number no more is no greater than or than what than the sum of two means two sum of two and three times the number three times what that number k 
So this is easy, man. You know. So now let's solve this. So what we're gonna do here? We're gonna cross multiplication. See, I'm gonna cross multiplication. I'm gonna multiply three on the left, three on the right. So this and this gonna cancel. So we're gonna be left with k less or equal to. Now, uh, two times three equal to six plus means you multiply for the first one and for the second group. Three times three equal to nine. But I'm having k. So what we're gonna do here? Take this nine k to the left because this is k. You k must come over. So this is plus is gonna come minus 9k and then it will be less or equal to 6k is 1k right minus 8k minus 9k is going to give us negative 8k less or equal to 6 i want to get a value of k what i'm going to do divide by negative 8 divide by negative 8 this and this cancel so k see this is less since i divided by negative just like i say the moment you have inequality and you divide by negative the direction of the inequality is going to change so since you divide by negative here, it's not going to be less or equal, it's going to be greater or equal to. If you divide 6 divided by 8, it's going to give you uh, 0 0.75, I think so. 0 0.75, right? Yes, 0 0.75. So it's going to give us negative 0 0.75. Oh, so now if you draw this on number line, even if I don't look there, look. What that means, look. If this is 0, let's say this is, let's say this is. 1 okay and this is negative 1 so k is greater or equal look is 0 0.75 what that mean this is let's say this is 0 this is 1 this is like 0 this is like 0 0.25 this is like 0 0.5 and this can be 0 0.75 and this can be 1 so 0 0.75 means but our negative means this is negative 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 means start from here but including means like this and then Go to the right to go to the right. Okay, so this is k greater than negative greater equal. That's what I put solid here. Zero seven five. Which is gonna be option one? This is true because look, zero negative one means this is gonna be zero point two five. Look, you go to the left, it's gonna be negative one, zero point two five, and then this is gonna be negative zero point five, and this is gonna be negative zero comma. So this is true and it's going to be solid because this stuff is including like so it's going to go to the right. So option two is correct. Look man. Everywhere. Uh -huh. to everywhere. Everywhere. Uh -huh. to everywhere. Yes, like, thanks. It's just a waste of time. When you do this question and it's easy like that man. Thanks a lot. Of you know what I'm saying? Look man, I believe in learning from how to do things. If it's time. Make sure you subscribe and you know, you can just go and do donation to our Patreon page. I have a Patreon, I have a GoFundMe, you know what I'm saying? I have all the means of donation because to make this project going, you know, any type of donation, the little that you think is too small for you, it could make a lot of change and things a lot for all your time, you know, subscribe, don't forget, share this video, circulate to a lot of people, you know, because the meaning of this project is program. It's to help as many as we can, okay? It's not only for one patient or two, because you might think it's not helpful for you, but for somebody next out there, it could be very, very helpful. So thanks a lot, man. And you know, any donation that you did to me, it means so much. I appreciate man. It means a lot. Go to our Patreon page. Go to our uh, GoFundMe, because we need to have, a, you know, a lot of things we need to put them together, like camera, you know, and a lot of equipment so that we can improve on you know, a lot of anger, a lot of aspects of these projects, you know. Thanks a lot, man. I appreciate and I love you. Peace and love. Bye. You know, this is one of my students of knowledge. You know, she wanted to introduce herself. What's your name? Could you please introduce yourself? My name is Kamri. Yeah. I'm from St. Mary's School. Yeah, I'm trying to work I'm trying to work I'm trying to work back. Just everywhere, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> So this is my other son, his name, what's your name? Matthew. Matthew, yeah, he's grade 11, man. So his aim is to score distinction, right? So you promise, I want you to score distinction this time. And what's your name? Joshua. Joshua, well, how much you promise me to score this time? Distinction. <laughs> distinction? <laughs> yeah, so I'm trying to buy you everywhere, man. I'm trying to buy you everywhere. I'm trying to buy you everywhere. Everywhere. I'm trying to buy you everywhere. Exactly. Everywhere. Thanks a lot, man. Appreciate it. Thanks so much.
to give advice, or which advice would you give uh, to the people or to the city? Trust damage. <laughs> why, why would they trust me? No, because it's really good. They actually has helped a lot. Uh, first, I, I read it first year for maths. It was my own fault, but also I didn't know a lot of the work. And Hamish said lots of hard questions, and it's it's demotivating sometimes to do the harder stuff. You like, just want to get done, but it's the hard stuff that makes you realize the easy stuff is easy.